Okay, so a styrofoam spherical ball of uh, radius 2 millimeters and mass uh, 20 microgram is to be suspended by radiation pressure in a vacuum tube in a lab. How much intensity will be required if the light completely is completely absorbed? So it's an energy equation? It's no pressure equation. So here is a styrofoam ball and we'll assume it's got a flat surface. Uh, so but I've drawn it as a spear. So here is gravity trying to pull it down. And what you're going to do is you're going to use your laser, green laser, to suspend it. <laughs> okay. We're going to assume that, uh, so the radiation exerts a pressure. And the problem says we are going to assume that the styrofoam ball is absorbing the radiation. So, I mean, I'll give a very gruesome ex example. You, when somebody gets shot, momentum is transferred to them. Mm -hmm. So this is, so what you're doing is here, okay, we'll keep it there. Here's a sack and you're shooting bullets at the sack. The sack is absorbing the bullets and it's remain, it's to be remain suspended. At what intensity do you need to shoot to keep it suspended? Okay, so that's the, all right, um, pressure, okay. and I hope I remember the expression right, somebody can check, pressure equal to P is given by average pointing vector divided by C, and uh, please check the expression, it's uh, E max, B max divided by two mu naught divided by C. How much intensity will be required? Okay, so yeah, and S is the intensity, so S average is the intensity. Oops. Uh, now, force equal to pressure times area and that should equal mg. So i times c equal to pi r square equal to m times g. So i, the intensity required is the weight of the styrofoam ball times the speed of light divided by the area of cross section of the styrofoam ball. Yep. So let's add a page. <clears throat> okay, so the intensity of the light beam needed is mgc pi r square. m is a micrograms, 20 microgram, 10 minus 6, but you have to convert that to kg, so 10 minus 9 kg. G is 9.8 meters per second square. C is uh, 3 times 10 to the 8 meters per second. And pi r square pi, the radius is of radius 2 millimeters. 2 into 10 minus 3 square. Okay, again, let's take care of powers of 10. That's 10 minus 8. That kills that. You have 10 minus 6 at the bottom. So that comes to the top, becomes 10 to the plus 6. So 10 to the plus 6. Units are watts per meter square. 2 into 9.8 into 3 divided by 2, uh, 4 pi. That's 2 square, which makes it 4 pi. So the intensity is
Okay, 4.68 times 10 to the 6 milliwatts uh, per meter squared. Remember, the sunlight had one point, uh, well, sunlight was a 10 to the power 3 watts per meter squared. So, you could suspend a styrofoam ball, a microgram styrofoam ball, with light of intensity, um, this is uh, 10,000 times as intense as sunlight. Details, details, details. <laughs> we won't worry about that. <laughs>